हेलो स्टूडेंट आई होप योर प्रिपरेशन इज गोइंग गुड एज आई वाले डे प्रोवाइडेड द डिटेल्ड एनालिसिस ऑफ स्टडी एंड डे आफ्टर स्टडीज वीडियोस एंड आल्सो वी विल गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द टूडेज पेपर एनालिसिस बेस्ड ऑन द स्टूडेंट फीडबैक एंड द रिव्यू व्हिच इज गॉट फ्रॉम द डिफरेंट स्टूडेंट फ्रॉम द मॉर्निंग एज वेल एज आफ्टरनून सेशंस एंड दीज आर मेमोरी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन नॉट द एग्जैक्ट क्वेश्चन सो दैट यू विल गेट द आइडिया व्हाट वाज द नेक्स्ट फ्यू डेज अपकमिंग पेपर ऑफ बीआरसी एनालिसिस सो द फॉर द टूडेज बोथ द शिफ्ट दे विल आस्क अराउंड 10 टू 12 क्वेश्चन इन द फर्स्ट शिफ्ट एंड second shift they will ask around 14 to 18 question from the strength of material and the important area which they have focused on that you need to first focus on deflection of beam maximum bending moment like they have asked a few question from the deflection of beam they will ask like they will provide the diagram you need to calculate that maximum deflection and uh, they will also ask a few of the question related to static deflections and if going ahead with the like maximum bending moment they will give in a diagram you need to calculate based on the diagram simply supported along with the cantilever beam they will ask a question related to the maximum bending moment and also based on area you can easily calculate over there as well few of the question from the elastic constant and basic uh, related to the principal stresses they will ask few of the question over there as well so the total they will get around 10 to 12 questions based on the shift morning as well as afternoon and if you take in on an average you will get around 14 question from the strength of material going ahead with the fluid mechanics they will ask a basic properties of fluid mechanics statics kinematics and they mostly focus on a total acceleration diagram and calculation of power and based on the different conditions of fluid machineries they will ask a few question over there based on the turbine as well as pump as well so they will basically need to calculate the total flow rate and they will given some criteria and a few of the question they will ask around the bending of pipes uh, over there you need to calculate the force so these are the question which is repeated from yesterday as well as today's paper as well going ahead with the thermodynamic they will ask mostly on the two topic like first law of thermodynamic second law of thermodynamic both both the questions are mostly mixed questions not for the exactly similar type of question which they have asked previously but question is little bit lengthy from the strength of material along with the thermodynamic uh one more thing like fluid mechanics they will ask a few of the question from the uh, diagram basic like you need to calculate the uh, data based on the given diagram along with the theoretical i do not recommend solve all those question of strength of material along with the fluid mechanics those question having more than 8 to 10 lines of question so do not solve these types of question going ahead with the theory of machine the most of the questions from the two topic gear and so there is an important topic related to the free body diagram they will given us some question you need to calculate the calculate the degree of freedom they will uh, provide the diagram you need to calculate that diagram as little bit uh, tricky questions like that you can say that and uh, basically few of the question from the uh, different mechanism they will provide these are the theoretical questions they will given and these are the like if you have study and already solved the gate previous year question sufficient to solve these types of question going ahead with the production they will most of the question they will ask about the welding and casting questions yesterday they will also ask these questions and questions all from the numerical type most of the question few of the question from the forming as well the difference is that only they will change the data of gate numerical everything remains the same even though questions are also same you need to only remember a formula and you need to put it you will get the final answer and few of the questions from the metrology these are the theoretical question and few of the question from the metrology like one to two question which i have received from the student and a few of the numerical is also received from the forming going ahead with the ic and product like uh, ppe so power plant they will ask uh, one question from the diesel cycle one from the uh, like mixture of other cycles and uh, basically you need to calculate the uh, efficiency in that particular questions and the uh, one auto cycle they will ask a uh, basic questions and uh, going ahead with material they will ask uh, iron carbide diagram properties of that you need to basically calculate the like they will given a uh, mcq questions so you need to select based on the diagram which they have given over there and uh, from the industrial and engineering mechanics they will ask industrial mostly they will ask from the uh, waiting and uh, waiting time and other related to the different time and uh, few questions they will ask around, uh, about the simplex they will given a uh, like a diagram they will given a diagram you need to calculate the uh, value of x and uh, one question they will ask about the like uh, different uh, productions planning they will ask a theoretical question student student does not remember the exact question but they will ask related to that particular questions few other question they will ask but the data are not exact that's why they will not able to explain me 
so few questions from the mechanics like the frictions they will ask most of the important question because every paper they will ask two questions from the friction and a few uh, like dynamic questions they will ask if you remember the basic mechanics you can easily solve these questions as well going ahead with the engineering mathematics they will ask six to seven question one from probability one from linear algebra two questions from the calculus part and one question from the numerical method they will ask going ahead with the machine design they will ask a th theory of failures and one questions based on the design of welding they will ask you need to calculate the total forces and in a heat transfer they will focus on the two area conduction as well as heat exchanger if you able to solve the conduction resistance based on the total heat transfer you can easily solve these questions as well and from the heat transfer like uh, heat exchangers they will ask especially uh, counter flow heat exchangers type of questions a uh, few questions related to the parallel heat, heat exchanger these are the theoretical as well as numerical questions so these are the overall area which they have asked for the today's paper and these are the both shift analysis i do not exactly remember the question and even though i do not receive the question exact question from the student but based on the total review of the both the shift i will make a total count what was the question they will ask so i hope this video are informative if you think then do like and share with your friend and subscribe this channel